Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for Tuesday, August 14th. Now, this is for all signs, but, you know, if it resonates, it resonates. If it doesn't, it doesn't. This is what I'm picking up on today. We're going to get one of these angel romance cards, first and foremost, and then... I might even get another oracle card because it's, I just I keep looking at them. So let's see. Whatever happens, happens. And that's the way it is. You know, and every word that comes out of my mouth is, is part of the message. Whatever happens, happens. Right? Un, unrequited love. As my cat hisses. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Makes sense. It does. It makes sense. Unrequited love. It's just not there. It's just not whatever happens, happens. If you don't try, you won't know, right? Right. Let's get one of these, too. That one fell out. Reflect. You know, take take your time. Look inside your own crystal ball. Okay? We all have it. It may be an invisible crystal ball, but you have it. Take that time to figure out what it is that you want, what you see. What do you see for your future? Keep your eyes open. Joy lives in small places. I just have to check something real quick. I had to make sure my cat didn't bring in like a bird or something because I see I hear all kinds of noise down there. So my doors are open, so sometimes they'll bring a, last week, what, they brought a rabbit in. Headless. Oh, goodness. So somebody is wanting to take another step. You know, they're, they're taking steps in the right direction trying to keep balance in their lives. <laughs> okay, so let me just get this zoomed in before we go any further. Of course, we got that wonderful Seven of Swords, right? Because, you know, I'm just going to zoom right in over to here. There we go. Somebody has to make a decision, and they are in the process of making a complex decision as to keep going, to keep making those steps, to keep moving forward. You know, they need to decide whether they want to keep fighting for something, why, if they want to give it another chance or not. What do I want to do? What do I want to do here? Should I just give up on this? There's somebody isn't taking action, though. They're living. There's a lot of confusion going on. There's definitely some indecision here. There is. There's some indecision in regards to what direction to take. And maybe you have two options because that's what I see. I feel like somebody has two options. You know, do I move forward or do I stay where I'm at? Do I, you know, somebody has to make a choice. I mean, these are both choice cards. One situation, there's not enough attraction or chemistry. There's not. In one situation, it's like, I 
don't even know why I'm here. I don't. I don't know why I'm here. Why? There's really no reason for it. There's no passion. Somebody is in a situation where there isn't any passion. But, you know, they may be staying for, who knows, codependency reasons, materialistic reasons. Maybe, maybe, you know, they're just waiting for the better option to appear. There's definitely some wanting to come out of hiding. And, you know, somebody's hiding. You know, they're hiding. from somebody, they, something they left behind. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Somebody is in denial because I see the Two of Swords and the Two of Swords is somebody that's in denial. So I think that somebody is in denial wanting to take a step in a perhaps a new direction but unable to find the strength to do so. And it's like living in an illusion probably with a situation that isn't I mean it's unrequited you know what I mean it's not desirable the moon escape the moon I mean we all know what the moon is the moon is escaping it's escapism it's be careful something is all is not something is not as it seems it's not somebody is hiding they're hiding. And they think they're getting away with it. They think that nobody knows. But they want to go back. They want to go back. Somebody wants to go back, but they're hiding. Hiding behind a wall. Hiding behind a pillar. Now the two of swords is the truth. Hiding behind, you know, in denial. And this is absolutely um, confirming it with the moon. There's a secret. Somebody is absolutely keeping a secret here. Has to do with a commitment. Ooh, and it ends in love. It ends in love. So in order for it to end in the Ace of Cups, somebody has to get in their vehicle and take action. Somebody has to master their emotions and find the strength that has been lost. Somebody has damn near given up. Could be you or the person, you know, that's been waiting. Somebody is at, is at the brink of, of, I am completely done. I'm closing this door. But the other person is being divinely guided to get moving. Now I say divinely guided because we have all these sevens. Seven, seven, seven. It's a number from heaven. Somebody is being divinely guided to make a move, to master their emotions, find the willpower, replace the fear with faith, and head in the right direction. Take the lead. Get in the driver's seat. That's what this is. Now, on the side of this chariot card, and somebody's finding their mental strength. Okay, somebody needs to find their mental strength. They do, to bring success and victory to their life. You have to find that force within you. It's all there is to it. There's no wish fulfillment, and there's no contentment until you do. There's no happiness. There's no happiness. There's no happiness until you take the lead, until you take charge. These are both no happiness. You have to be the boss. You have to take you have to take it in your own hands to bring success and victory to your life. You have to master your emotions and find that strength and replace that fear with faith. And you and if you want to escape and and lie about it and hide from the truth, it's only going to keep you unhappy. Somebody's being a player.
eventually you have to you have to get off of that and stop playing the game. There's definitely a lot of illusion here and confusion and indecisiveness. Somebody's wanting to hide from the truth and it's really doesn't bring any happiness. It doesn't bring happiness to them. Somebody needs to find the strength to, to take action. Take action. But here we have here we have the, the contrast, okay? Not taking action. No action, action. Underneath this no action. No happiness, no wish fulfillment underneath this no action. I don't take action, I don't find wish fulfillment. A complex decision. What do I want? What do I want? Do I want this unrequited love or do I want the real deal? Because that's what this is. You have to make a choice. Do you want this unrequited love with somebody that is whatever? I mean, there's no chemistry. There's no attraction. Whatever. Or do you want real love? You have to make a choice. There's an opportunity for true love. If you free yourself, this is freedom, liberation, goodbye, done. End. Completion. So there is an opportunity for love here. Real love. A rebirth, a renewal. Even a reconciliation. Could be. But somebody has to free themselves from their illusion, their confusion, and this unrequited love situation. That's all there is to it. You have to be honest with yourself. And somebody hasn't been. They've been trying to escape the truth. And it's hard sometimes because we try to replace. We try to replace, you know, our hurt with somebody new. And that doesn't work. Sometimes it does, but not very often. There's definitely a lot, a lack of wish fulfillment and a lack of happiness. Because somebody doesn't have the strength, but they do. They haven't been. They haven't found it. They're not using it. They're giving up. Whatever, but they have it inside of them. They just need to find it and and get their ass in gear. This is a card of transformation as well. Somebody is being divinely guided, like I said, to make a move, to get moving. Do you, want to, do you want to escape love? Are you trying to escape love? Are you trying to escape commitment? Are you trying to escape forever? The universe is trying to bring you together with somebody. That's what I see. There's something going on behind the scenes here. There is. But somebody is is not allowing, they're not allowing themselves to see things clearly, whatever it is. There's there's somebody is is choosing to live in an illusion and confusion. They're choosing it. It's a choice. It is a choice. It's a choice, 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 it's a choice. I choose to pretend. I mean, two of swords is pretend that I'm happy when I'm not. So I feel like today is a day of, well, maybe even 
coming out of hiding. It's up to you. I mean, some people, they, they have to. Some people will find the mental strength to do so. Some will not. I mean. Oh, my gosh. It could lead to a beautiful partnership. Love. The two cups. There's an opportunity for true love here. A soulmate connection. For love. A partnership. A union. But somebody's choosing not to see it or offer it. Being stubborn. No, I don't want your love. What? Refusing to apologize. Refusing to settle. To settle down. Not wanting to do the right thing. Somebody is walking away from true love because of their ego. Turning their back. Somebody is turning their back and not allowing any growth or new opportunities to blossom because they don't have integrity. Their ego is huge. They're ignoring the offer of love, of a soulmate connection, and therefore it looks like somebody else is going to turn their back and walk away. This is what this is. Somebody is headed in a new direction because... They're not getting what they need. There's a soulmate connection here. Okay, there's a soulmate connection here. One person is not reciprocating. Although they love. Okay, although they do love. They, they do love. Their, their ego is humongous at this point. Okay, really huge. Huge, huge, huge. Because look, look at him. He's like, I don't even need that. I don't want that even though I do. Okay, so anyway, uh, there's, there's, there's a lot of ego here. Somebody doesn't want to doesn't want to do the right thing. They don't have integrity. They're very confused about what they want. They they want to go back, but they're protecting themselves by hiding. Living very a very unhappy, unfulfilled life, but you know, the ego is ruling at this point. And so therefore, I think the other person is giving up. The other person in this connection, cuz you see that the two of cups is connected to both of these. We got this we got this person who's who's hiding in hiding but wanting to go back. This person's given up on this connection. Because I deserve I deserve love. I need love. So somebody is walking away from a love connection that is going nowhere. So I feel like today is a day of, of making a choice. To move forward. To master your emotions. Put yourself in the driver's seat and take the lead in your own life. You are being divinely guided to move forward. Don't look back. Talk to you later.